Good evening, everybody. I got a shirt on. I got a shirt on, too. Yeah. So we are headed right now to the Epcot Resort area. We're probably gonna start in Boardwalk and make our way around. Um, but we're gonna talk food and wine today, but actually on the live stream on YouTube. So we will actually link that video above if you wanna hear us talk in detail about the different menus that were just released um, for food and wine and what we wanna try this year. I'll also link in the description the list of all of the menus um, as well. So we're excited about our shirts. We have to go through security real quick. Yeah, we'll be then, right back. Yeah. Alrighty, so I printed out 26 pages. That's how many it was, 26 pages wow. of menus. And you've seen our food and wine shirt, which Sarah has on, because we just got it, three shirts that we ordered today in the mail, first of our own merchandise. But you haven't seen this new one that just premiered today, or when you're watching this yesterday, it's on the website. Favorite table. We figured it'd be a good time. Our favorite trash cans. Yeah, our favorite trash cans, a good time to put it on the website, considering food and wine is just about here in a few weeks. And we eat on trash cans. We eat on trash all cans. The, we eat on trash cans all the time, but most definitely during food and wine. Doing food because and it's wine. so busy. Yeah. Can I have your phone? Because we're about to go live stream. Yes. This is where we ended up live streaming because it was air conditioning quiet. There was a freaky fly when we kept there was, there was, but usually they've got events in here. Luckily right now there was nothing going on because we had this whole space to ourselves other than just a few families walking past. Thanks for coming to the live stream. If yeah, you're right. thanks for doing it. And if you haven't, we said we're gonna link it below. it'll be linked if you want to go check it out. It was just a little food and wine discussion. Sarah's phone's going off. Sorry about that. And now we're going to leave this, the solarium and go to uh, meet up with Chelsea and Kristen at uh, Trivia. Here we are, Four Corners Tavern. It's newer, right? Yeah, it's actually, so this is where we first took leave to get groomed. Oh, this is it? I wasn't it with was you. It was under construction, yeah. Oh, so this is in Champions Gate. Yes. And they're doing a tune trivia tonight, so I'm Chelsea nervous. and Kristen are here. I'm a little nervous, but we're gonna, uh, we're gonna check it out. Don't know how much vlogging we'll be able to do, because I know some, some of these trivia places are a little bit intense. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> Look who's here. Oh, this is less pressure. Yeah. yeah. It's not as trivia as, as, as I thought. No. But it's cool. It'll be fun. Yeah. So we all have different boards. Yeah. yeah. Oh. We, we couldn't figure out what that was from. What is it? It's from the live action Beauty and the Beast. Oh. Yeah. I, I was, like, remember remember you were with us when we yeah. saw it live at the like, at studios. Immortals? What is that? That's, That's from, from Hero Yeah. Like oh. Yes, yeah, so we got this. Oh. Okay. I mean, of course, all the. Cole had those two on his car, and I was like, so I don't know what those are. We got this. Cole almost got it. By the way, Cole here. Cole almost got it. Kristen almost got it. Chelsea got none, don't worry, because I marked one and it wasn't right. So I got none either. I put a little X next to it. Yeah. 
muscles. Now it's classic rock. You gotta get the whole board. Blood on your face. Okay, your face. Okay, no, face. Like that, I'm only in the Guardians of the Galaxy. <laughs> rock you. I feel like Kristen's gonna win this. I have a feeling. You're gonna win this. We're like, like seven or eight songs in, and I literally only have, I literally only have these two. What's going on? This is still going on, still have not won. Sarah's creeping up. We lost! We were so close! So we're pretending like we're not going to work tomorrow. <laughs> what time is it though? We'd usually be out anyway. So we haven't told you yet. We'll explain when we get home, but we're doing this new thing. We go to bed at 1 a.m. We get up at 6. Okay. Strict schedule. Strict. I'm gonna start going to work a little later because it's okay if I go to work later. Um, I've been going way too early for the past 12 months, yeah. so I'm gonna go later. We're gonna get it. We're gonna, that's our new sleeping schedule. Now we're at infamous Miller's Ale House, and Sarah just surprised me with some knowledge. Tyler's coming. So we may may experience either a tummy time with tummy time with Tyler, or it's a. Really Crossover episode of yeah. Chelsea, Kristen, and Cole and we, Tyler we finally did, meeting. We've never realized. Yeah, we we realized tonight. Chelsea pointed out was like I've never actually met this Tyler guy, which is weird because Chelsea is such a big part of her life. Tyler is such a big part of her life, so it'll be exciting. It's a sensible time to eat some oatmeal. <laughs> Let hot. me explain myself. We were on vacation, so we made sure we didn't buy groceries before vacation. We haven't... Eve just got some oatmeal, so she's drinking water. We're going to Naples this weekend, so like, we had a hard time like justifying going to buy groceries if we're leaving this weekend, and bringing Eve with. So we haven't gotten groceries yet, so we're like bone dry, so I'm eating oatmeal. We're gonna give Eve a bath tonight. Uh-huh. So we haven't explained, like, we've decided we're gonna give ourselves a sleeping schedule. Now, you may think this is crazy, but we're starting at what we think is our bare minimum, and we're going to adjust accordingly. We're going to go to bed we've every night. We've definitely day. slept less than this before. We've definitely slept less, but we've also slept more. So really, I don't think we truly know what our like minimum amount is. So we're going to go to bed every night at 1 a.m., and we're going to wake up at 6 a.m. I realize that my work schedule, like with its kind of flexibility, I can leave at... 7 or 8 a.m. Like 8 a.m. the latest I could leave for work. So like we're gonna go to bed at 1, get up at 6, whether it's I run, whether it's I just mosey around. Um, that's what we're gonna do. If we think we need more, we'll kick it back to 12.30. We're just we, gonna try out. If we need as more. As long as it's a schedule. We'll kick it back to 12. Like I feel like with our bad sleeping habits, like if we're just consistent, it'll be better. Mm -hmm. So that's what we're, our goal is. Yes. So we're gonna use our time tonight to give Eva bath. Yeah, we'll be able to be more efficient for you guys as well. Like whether yeah. it's Instagram, projects, mm -hmm. shirt designs, or just cleaning, like doing our dishes, doing dishes, yeah. cleaning Eve. So tonight yeah. we're gonna give Eve a bath because it's only midnight, so we have an hour before bedtime. We have, but we're 26, 27. <laughs> he doesn't know how old we are. We're 26 years old. 26 years old, and we're giving ourselves bedtimes. Oh, <laughs> I just put the camera on her, and she ran so fast. Are you ready? He's like, shoot. Do you have a power on here? Yeah, you could use that one. So cute. She's so cute. You alright? <laughs> She's going too fast. She's trying to get her sense back. This is her August bow. We've officially gone through all 12 months. This was from last year. Alrighty, so I just hung up our laundry. Um, and Peter is actually already asleep. 
just had to get that last little bit of laundry done and now I am off to bed. It's kind of weird like getting back from vacation, trying to get back into the swing of things, but also we'll be gone for the weekend. So not that like we have to unpack to pack, um, but just getting laundry done and getting situated so that when we leave, we feel good while we're away. So yeah, I'll leave it at that. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>